Tonight's 10th race has a field of seven. They are lining up in behind the Metro Home Building Center starting gate. Let's go back upstairs to track announcer Vance Cameron. Stealing bases. Private dancer Jay's Little Spark, Miss Cabetta. Top of her trade, wickedly sinful. How much jazzy girls on the outside? Field of seven here in the 10th. Top of the stretch. Approaching a start. The rough and facing stealing bases off the rail leaves out alongside that is private dancer coming from the outside top of her trade. Three high for third. Up fourth now on the outside is Miss Cabana. On the cones fifth is Jay's a little spark. Wickedly sinful goes sixth. Then the early trailer. That's how Mac Jazzy girl up the back stretch they go. And here comes Mark Campbell aboard top of her trade to clear the lead as they arrive at the opening quarter mile. Second is Steve. Stealing bases, private dancer third, Miss Cabana fourth, Jay's a little sparks in fifth, wickedly sinful goes fifth, followed by the trailer, Hamak Jazzy girl 29, and one opened it up, they're in straight alignment as they arrive at the 3H, and it's top of her trade, and she is the heavy favorite on the engine, racing from second is stealing bases, private dancer third, fourth and going to the outside is Miss Cabana, fifth up the rail, Jay's a little spark, on the outside six is wickedly sinful, and to the outside the trailer, Hamak Jazzy girl, one minute! And two was the half, a comfortable 31 and two second quarter. Racing around the turn, 31 and one was the second panel. And it's top of her trade going to the back stretch for time two. Stealing bases is second, wickedly sinful. A three wide and coming on third. Fourth up the rail is private dancer, Hamak Jazzy Girl, swinging out three wide fifth. Then in six, Jay's a little spark. Miss Caban on the outside, seven, three quarters up in one. 130 and four eighth of a mile left to go wickedly sinful now has her head in front top of her trade is second stealing bases third hamak jazzy girl fourth deep stretch now coming to the wire wickedly sinful on the line for taylor doyle tight for the deuce we're gonna need a place picture but it's wickedly sinful in the tenth one Fifty nine three. Here comes the slow mo replay brought to you by Universal Media for tonight's tenth race. And we saw top of her trade go to the front, 29 and one, the half up a minute, two fifths. Down to three quarters, 130 and four. There was all kinds of action. Wickedly sinful, sent hard right after the leader here and drives on by to get up to get the victory tonight. New record, 159 and three. Taylor Doyle in the driver's seat for Robin LeJeunesse. In there for second, it's close on the line, but it is posted now. The five top of her trade hung, hang on, hangs on for second. Stealing bases in there for third, and the seven, How Mac Jazzy Girl is fourth, six five one seven unofficially in tonight's 10th race. And we'll see Wickedly Sinful with Taylor Doyle in the Woodmere Standard Bridge Winter Circle next.
The punters were tagging along with the race secretary, Gerard Smith. He nailed it in the classifier selections here. And it's wickedly sinful going to the 10th race winner's circle. Facing Brown Philly 3 by McWicked. Off the intrepid Sealster Dam, spouting off. Owned by Robin Lodginess of Summerside, bred by the SSG Stable of North Boston, New York. Taylor Doyle training and driving and guiding the Philly to a new pacing record of 159-3. Wickedly sinful in the 10th. 